The built-in Tools module gives us a function called accumulate, which has some rather interesting effects. So say for example, I have this list of numbers here. If we call accumulate over this, by default, it's going to use sum as its function, and it's going to do the running total of all these numbers. So let's set this up and try a few examples. So looking at the output, we can see 10, 15, 17. That's basically just going from left to right and then keeping a running total all the way until the end. However, what you can do is make this a bit fancier by passing in a custom function. So let's suppose for example, we can go ahead and say max. This time it will keep track of the biggest number it sees as it moves down, and because 10 is the biggest, it's going to keep track of that all the way to the end. But say for example, if we change the second number to 50, it'll start off at 10, it'll recognize that 50 is bigger, go to 50, and then because nothing's bigger than 50, it'll keep the 50 all the way to the end. The inverse is true if we use the min function. So this time we see our numbers decreasing up until we hit the one here, which then stays until the end. And then say for example, you wanted to do a product rather than sum, we could import the mul tool from the operator module. And looking at the output here, we can see it is indeed doing a running product rather than a running sum.